We got in this room. We gonna room the room. We working. We just some young black men and women working, doing legal work. Jennifer Lopez and Ben Affleck are clearly in a rough patch in their marriage of what less than two years at this yeah. point because we know they are living in separate households right now. We got back together. It was just like. I want to make music again. I want to get back in the studio. I was very, very inspired. And when I think about, I was like, the same way This Is Me then captured that moment in time without me realizing it. Mm. The first time we kind of fell in love, I wanted to capture this moment in time. It is not so cool when you start to own things. You see what I'm saying? So I made a lot of money with them too. Like there's a point, they, they did a deal that mirrored what Puffy's deal with Diageo was for Syrah. So he didn't have ownership but at any point, but he was getting a lot of money, like almost like $60 million a year at one point. So you see him go to daily on is when you see him have some issues. And these people have really strong relationships. Don't think that the civil case doesn't turn into a criminal case faster because he's making that them uncomfortable. That's a big part of it. The spirits business is it's not governed. They got a discus board that they created, right? If you got two companies that are $3 billion, year and beam centauria and diageo the the distribution level is very hard for you to get things to a point where you can do the numbers the right numbers they incentivize the sales force by giving them box bonuses and then when you sell a product you get the bonuses off the boxes that's there but you make that no matter what product you're selling that they were seen in public together in gosh uh, more than a month yeah, yeah 47 Four, days 47 days the flowers were not for ben yeah. but they both showed up with flowers they went to go see one of ben's kids was starring in a play last night school play and jen was there as right. well with emmy and they all went in together as a family and they went and saw the play and then afterward ben drove jen and emmy home to beverly hills mm. And this is like their one public outing in weeks because he didn't even come support her at the Met Gala when she was a co-chair. So like, obviously this was planned and it's just so fun. Always, for better or for worse, have followed my heart <laughs> and, my, and my instincts. And this is where it brought me to. I rewind this back. We used to go to the, when we go to the club, we used to have these bottles, right? And on this bottle, they'd be, they'd be regular Moet bottles. On them bottles right there, they've been to have something to make the girls be real, real slippery and all of this kind of stuff. So when you get up, they'd be like, don't touch them bottles right there and only drink them bottles right there. So we already knew what the drill was. You just don't mess with them bottles. Right there. Love in some ways. Yeah. But then they realized there was difficulty and maybe, you know, they've grown apart. They're two completely different people. Are people always worried about what face Ben has on? Like if he did, if Ben know. like walks out the house and he's like, all right. doesn't, I feel like actually get mentioned enough. If I could just end on one yes. thing is that Jen is a producer on this movie. Yes. And the reason why I'm here and the reason why Sterling was in this beautiful movie is because Jen cares, and Jen cares about things like representation and diversity, and she's a boss, and she's an incredible creative and an icon, and that's what I think we should celebrate her for today. Heinous crimes that tons of people knew about, from car bombs to assaults to crimes, it's like P. Diddy was going for some kind of high score, trying to catch every possible crime like a Pokemon. He has terrorized the music industry for decades and ruined so many lives. In recent times, the evidence against him to support all the allegations that have existed for decades has been overwhelming and led to a large investigation against P. Diddy. And now it looks like we're reaching the climax climactic finale with him being arrested. When this story broke last night, the indictment was sealed, but this morning they said, open the gates, let them see. To sum it up, he has been charged with by force transportation to engage in prostitution and racketeering conspiracy, alleging he ran an enterprise that engaged in trafficking forced labor or arson and other crimes. He abused, threatened, and coerced women and others around him to, to fulfill his desires protect his reputation and conceal his conduct from 2008 till now the allegations mirror 11 civil complaints filed against him since 2020 so ben affleck and jennifer lopez didn't just suddenly start hanging out together two weeks ago he started reaching out to her 
in February, sending her emails. One thing you can always trust in, oh God, family. Let me do our best, we're gonna try our best. You don't need to worry about Ben, let me just tell you. <laughs> okay, we're not doing that. <laughs> thank you so much, guys, really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. You know better than that. Juan, don't come in here with that energy, please. But I felt very, very good because I knew the size of the lady game uh, uh, yeah no did it Pete Paul's now I'm just saying I just knew it. I just cause you know I know they just wait they wait they just <laughs> waiting on you we knew the lit I'm talking about in basketball terms don't y'all be going this so I'm gonna go ahead I'm just the one time I'm saying it for Ocho and I on nightcap no did it we knew the lady game cars were too big for the Iowa Hawkeyes that size six foot seven Cardosa mm -hmm. you had a uh, what oh that was quick Apparently, Ben and Jen are already on the outs again after less than two years of marriage. Hi, this is Erica, and today we're diving into a storm that's rapidly swirling around Ben Affleck, putting him right in the middle of an unexpected and very public media whirlwind. Hollywood may shine bright with its glitz and glamour, but it often hides darker stories beneath the surface, and now Affleck is caught in one of them. The frenzy began when rumors about secret tapes involving Jennifer Lopez and her former flame, Sean Diddy Combs, started making rounds. Back in the late 90s, Lopez and Diddy were the it couple, commanding more attention than almost any other. Now, decades later, whispers of these tapes have rekindled interest in their past, and new allegations are fanning the flames of controversy. The tapes, allegedly discovered during an FBI raid on Diddy's properties, have sparked wild speculation about their contents. These aren't just any tapes. They supposedly reveal intimate moments from Lopez and Diddy's relationship that were never meant for public consumption. For Ben Affleck, who rekindled his romance with Lopez in 2021, the timing of this scandal couldn't be worse. Sources close to the couple have hinted that Affleck is struggling to process the emotional weight of what he's been shown. While the tapes haven't been made public yet, Insiders are already buzzing about their potentially explosive contents, material that could create a serious rift between Lopez and Affleck. As the rumors swirl, it seems like Lopez's past is threatening to disrupt her present, dragging Affleck along with it. Affleck and Lopez, who reunited after nearly two decades apart, are now faced with challenges neither of them saw coming. The spotlight that once celebrated their rekindled romance has turned into a relentless glare, exposing their private lives as every tabloid and social media platform dissects the controversy. Affleck, who's known for being more private compared to the bold and charismatic Lopez, suddenly finds himself in the center of a storm that shows no signs of slowing down. But the plot thickens. Enter Sug Knight, Diddy's infamous rival, who has added more fuel to the fire. According to Knight, the FBI gave Affleck a courtesy call, and what they showed him wasn't just a simple warning. Knight suggests that Affleck was shown footage from Lopez's time with Diddy, footage that could change how Affleck sees his wife and their future together. Knight's comments have sent the media into overdrive, as everyone now wonders what Affleck saw and how it might be affecting his marriage. Whatever's on those tapes, it's clearly not just gossip. It's serious enough to shake the foundation of this relationship is couple. becoming increasingly visible. While Jennifer Lopez has remained silent, seemingly distancing herself from the scandal, Ben Affleck has reportedly been more openly affected. Sources close to the couple reveal that the emotional toll of seeing Lopez's past in such an unfiltered and intimate way has undeniably impacted their relationship. It's one thing to know about your partner's history, but it's something entirely different to have it exposed so publicly and raw. These tapes, which reportedly capture moments between Lopez and Diddy from over two decades ago, moments never meant to resurface, have left Affleck wrestling with deep discomfort and uncertainty. As the media continues to pry, the questions only multiply. Are these tapes the spark that has ignited the recent tension between Affleck and Lopez? Or are they just another obstacle in a relationship that has always been scrutinized? Each day brings fresh rumors and sensational theories, intensifying the pressure on the couple. For Affleck, who has spent years battling his own personal challenges in the public eye, this new ordeal is especially difficult. He's worked hard to rebuild his career and life, finally reaching a place of stability. But now, as the ghosts of Lopez's past resurface in such a public way, it feels like the ground is shaking beneath him once again. Lopez, on the other hand, has chosen a different approach, remaining quiet amidst the growing controversy. 
her silence has sparked its own wave of speculation. Is she protecting herself and her family, or is there more to the story? Old images, like the infamous photo of her and Diddy from a 2000 party, have resurfaced, fueling the fire. Fans and critics alike are dissecting every aspect of her relationship with Diddy, wondering how much of her past might still influence her present. As the media continues to dig, the pressure on both Lopez and Affleck only intensifies. With the media whirlwind gaining momentum, the strain on Ben Affleck and Jennifer Lopez's marriage is becoming harder to ignore. What was once a love story admired by millions is now under siege, with every detail of their private lives being broadcasted for public consumption. The tabloids are relentless, suggesting this scandal could mark the beginning of the end for the Hollywood power couple. Where there was once fascination and admiration, there's now scrutiny and doubt, as the couple faces a battle to protect their relationship the from the relentless glare of speculation that Jennifer Lopez's past with Diddy may be at the heart of the couple's recent turmoil. Although Lopez has yet to directly address the issue, sources close to her indicate that she's deeply frustrated by the renewed attention on a chapter of her life she believed was long buried. The legal troubles currently surrounding Diddy, which have brought these tapes to light, have only added fuel to the fire. Diddy's ongoing legal battles, including allegations of misconduct, have cast a shadow over anyone associated with him, and Lopez is no exception. Even though she has not been implicated in any of these accusations, the mere proximity of her past with Diddy has thrust her back into the headlines, exactly what she had hoped to avoid. The content of the tapes remains a mystery, with no clear details about what they might reveal. Yet, the rumors persist. Some speculate that the footage involves private, intimate moments between Lopez and Diddy, recorded during their high-profile relationship from 1999 to 2001. Others suggest the tapes may include behind-the-scenes clips from exclusive parties or gatherings hosted by Diddy, events in which Lopez frequently participated. Regardless of what's on these tapes, their existence alone has created an air of uncertainty around Lopez's current marriage, as if the ghosts of her past have resurfaced casting a long and uncomfortable shadow over her relationship with Ben Affleck. Adding more intrigue to the situation, Suganite's claims about the FBI's involvement have only poured more gasoline on the fire. Knight has implied that the FBI's so-called courtesy call to Affleck was not a mere notification. He suggests the authorities may have shown Affleck clips that no husband could easily overlook. The possibility that Affleck has witnessed private moments from Lopez's past, moments never meant to resurface, has added another layer of complexity to their already fragile relationship. Although it's unclear if Knight's allegations hold any truth, the idea that Affleck has seen something that could change his view of Lopez has ignited a new wave of speculation. It's not just the tapes themselves that are creating buzz, but the public's reaction as well. Social media, always quick to jump on the latest scandal, has been flooded with commentary. Some fans are defending Lopez, pointing out that everyone has a past and urging Affleck not to let long-buried moments affect their present. Others have taken a more critical stance, questioning why Lopez would rekindle her relationship with Affleck at a time when her past with Diddy seems to be making an unwelcome return. The conversation has turned into a battleground of opinions, with the couple's every move scrutinized under a microscope adding even more pressure to their Lopez, already tense situation. The resurgence of interest in her past with Diddy couldn't have come at a more inconvenient time. Her career, which spans over two decades and has seen her excel in music, film, and business, has often been shaped by how the public perceives her personal life. Though she's proven herself resilient, consistently rising above various scandals and setbacks, this latest chapter might be one of her toughest battles yet. The re-emergence of her relationship with Diddy a relationship tainted by legal trouble and controversy. Dominating the headlines is undoubtedly frustrating for Lopez, especially after her hard-fought efforts to distance herself from that period of her life. But where does this leave Ben Affleck? The media has been relentless in portraying him as a man struggling to cope with the revelations about his wife's past. While Affleck has remained largely silent in public, sources close to the couple suggest that he is grappling with intense feelings of betrayal and discomfort behind closed doors. It's important to remember that Lopez did nothing wrong. Her relationship with Diddy took place long before Affleck entered the picture. However, the sudden flood of new information, paired with relentless public scrutiny, has created an emotional whirlwind for Affleck. Having openly battled addiction and personal demons, this latest ordeal seems to be testing his strength in a way that's particularly challenging. 
as if the situation needed more complexity. The media continues to dig up old photos and stories from Lopez's time with Diddy. One particularly infamous photo, snapped at a 2000 party, shows Lopez and Diddy enjoying themselves during the peak of their fame. This image, along with many others, has resurfaced online, serving as a constant reminder of Lopez's past and adding fuel to the growing speculation surrounding her marriage. Fans and critics alike have been dissecting these images, drawing sharp comparisons between Lopez's relationship with Diddy and her life now with Affleck. The contrast is undeniable, and it has led some to question whether Lopez's history with Diddy is an ever-present obstacle that continues to impact her relationships, even her marriage to Affleck. As this story unfolds, the spotlight on Jennifer Lopez and Ben Affleck has only intensified. The media is fixated on drawing parallels between Lopez's high-profile romance with Diddy and her marriage to Affleck, painting a stark contrast that is as intriguing as it is troubling. Lopez's relationship with Diddy was defined by glitz, glamour, and its share of controversy, representing the fast-paced, high-stakes world of late 90s hip-hop culture that Diddy reigned over. At the time, Lopez was transitioning from a dancer and actress to a rising pop star, and their relationship was unavoidable in the headlines. Now, decades later, that era continues to cast its shadow on Lopez, even as she tries to move forward in her life with, with its Affleck. share of turbulence. Lopez and Diddy were involved in a highly publicized incident in 1999 when they fled the scene of a nightclub shooting in New York. Although Lopez was cleared of any wrongdoing, the scandal left a lasting stain on her reputation and complicated her relationship with Diddy. Not long after, their romance began to unravel. Rumors of infidelity swirled, and Lopez eventually walked away. Despite Diddy's efforts to win her back, which included grand gestures and lavish gifts, Lopez moved on, first into a short-lived marriage with dancer Chris Judd, and then into a whirlwind romance with Ben Affleck. In stark contrast, Lopez's relationship with Affleck, both during their initial engagement in the early 2000s and now in their rekindled marriage, has been shaped by a different kind of fame, one more rooted in old Hollywood elegance than in the opulence of her time with Diddy. Affleck, already an established star in his own right, brought a more stable, grounded energy to their relationship. In the public eye, Benefer was seen as a modern fairy tale, captivating fans and the media alike. Their engagement, highlighted by an enormous pink diamond ring, was headline news. But by 2004, the weight of media attention and public pressure led to the abrupt end of their engagement, leaving fans and tabloids in shock. When Benefer reunited in 2021, it felt like the long-awaited happy ending that fans had been hoping for. The couple appeared more mature, both having weathered their own personal storms. Affleck had faced his struggles with addiction and the highs and lows of his career, while Lopez had risen to the status of a global icon, juggling her career as a singer, actress, and entrepreneur. Their reunion was celebrated as a testament to love's resilience and ability to triumph over time. But now, with the resurfacing of these old tapes bringing Lopez's past with Diddy back into the spotlight, their marriage is facing challenges no one could have foreseen. The sharp contrast between Lopez's relationships with Diddy and Affleck has not gone unnoticed by fans or the media. Diddy's world was one of excess and controversy, while Affleck embodies a more introspective and private figure. However, the public scandal surrounding Lopez's past, particularly in connection to these tapes, has blurred the boundaries between those two worlds. For Lopez, keeping her past separate from her present has become increasingly difficult. The looming question is whether these old wounds will prove too deep for Lopez and Affleck's marriage to withstand. As if the strain from the tapes wasn't enough, Diddy's current legal troubles have only intensified the situation. He is now facing serious allegations of misconduct and ST, which have cast a fresh spotlight on his past relationships, including his time with Lopez. Although Lopez has not been implicated in any of the legal proceedings, her past association with Diddy during that chaotic period has pulled her back into the conversation, something she's been trying to avoid. For Lopez, who has meticulously crafted her public image over the years, this scandal threatens to unravel all of that hard work, dragging her back in into a narrative turmoil, she believed Ben she Affleck finds escaped. himself caught between his past struggles and his present challenges. He has been open about his battles with alcoholism and the pressures that come with fame, and now, as his marriage is thrust under intense public scrutiny. 
Once again, those pressures are building. The media has been relentless in speculating about Affleck's reaction to the tapes, with some reports suggesting that he has been deeply shaken by what he saw. Whether or not the tapes contain anything truly damaging remains unclear, but their mere existence has been enough to stir feelings of insecurity and unease within the relationship. Lopez, on the other hand, has chosen to stay silent, a decision that has only fueled more speculation. Her refusal to confront the scandal head-on could be seen as a way to shield her family and her career, but it also leaves room for the public to create their own narratives. Is she distancing herself from the situation because there's more to the story than we know? Or is she simply trying to leave behind a chapter of her life that she no longer wishes to be tied to? Whatever the reason, her silence has spoken volumes, leaving fans and critics alike to wonder what the next chapter will bring. As rumors continue to swirl, the future of Lopez and Affleck's marriage remains uncertain. Can they withstand the relentless media attention and the resurfacing of Lopez's past with Diddy? Or will the weight of these old scandals prove too heavy for their rekindled romance to survive? The media, always hungry for more drama, seems determined to keep this story in the spotlight. And with every new detail that emerges, the pressure on Lopez and Affleck only grows. Even if the tapes never see the light of day, their impact on one of Hollywood's most beloved couples could be irreversible. Only time will tell if Lopez and Affleck can weather this storm, or if the shadows of the past will ultimately tear them apart. In Hollywood, where fame and love are often intertwined, the line between public perception and private reality is always blurred. And for Lopez and Affleck, that line is becoming more difficult to navigate with each passing day.